What up guys, today I'm going to show you how to do dialogue boxes in various forms. Why? I don't know, because every video I see is either really old or really bad. So I'm going to see if I can show you just a few ways of which to do it. Not hard, it's actually usually really easy. And this will be done in Photoshop 2020. First thing you want to do, hit that new layer button. Which is right over here, the little plus sign with the square. Alright. Now the first way we're going to do it is super stupid. We're just going to make a big old circle. Yep, fill it. Yeah, just fill it in. Fill, fill it in real good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then make a little tail for it. This. Alright. Probably good enough. Then we'll go up here and edit stroke and because I forgot to change the color before be sure to switch the color before you do this because then you have to do this and like super slow and I press ok look we got a little dialog box also we could have done this way easier if we just did this way live and learn guys live and learn just make a little circle all right then there's uh, another way go over here to the ellipse tool or your shaping tools which will, you can get a whole bunch of different ones but just do this let's make a white one this time take a big old circle and then we'll go over here to the lasso tool but we're going to make the, the polygon lasso tool because we don't have any art skills do this do this and do this also uh, rasterize this uh this will also automatically make you a new layer which is good because if you're stupid like me and forget then just paint bucket the red part select deselect edit stroke forget to change the color again because you're dumb press ok press ok and those are hmm, a couple ways to do it as you can see there's a uh, various uh, levels of ability to do it. Sometimes you fail spectacularly like this. Then you gotta go there, fix it. And you'd be like, no, that sucks. And they're like, eh, 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 eh. Oh. Dude, there. But here's a way that like 99.9% .9 of people are going to do it. You're going to grab this tool, which is your marquee tool. Go up here to these buttons up here. Press this one. Remember the name of it. Like, add to layer, not. Yeah, tell me what this is. Yeah, there we go. Add to the selection. Just took a while. It was like, I don't know what it is. Anyways, make a big old circle. Go to your lasso tool. Also, make sure that add to selection is selected. Give yourself a nice little tail. Yeah. Bucket tool, eh. edit, stroke, forget again, every single time, just for consistency, to switch the colors before you hit the stroke tool, before you hit the stroke uh, in editor, press ok, select, deselect, and there you go, there's a few ways in which you can make a dialog box. Could you use the pen tool? Yes, you could use the pen tool. Should you use the pen tool? I don't know. I mean, if you're one of the few people in the world that can actually use the pen tool, make selection. Okay, no. Then use the marquee. Lasso tool, I should say. All right, hit that button. Fill. Switch. I did it, Ma. I did it. Be proud. And then press OK. Select, deselect, and there is several dialog boxes. And let's see, are there other ways to do it? Probably. There's like basically as long as you can make a circle, fill it, and stroke it, you'd probably be able to make a dialog box. Now I hear what you're saying, but what if after I make the dialog box, I don't know what to do after? I, I want to change things up. Well, that's easy. You just go to edit. 
free transform you can hit the gear this little box right here that again it doesn't tell you what it's called because you know things are gotta be difficult but this is like a little box with uh grids and stuff and that will effectively allow you to transform your bubble after you've already fucked it up yeah yeah look at that oh you ugly baby you ugly ugly thing who created you who created you and you can basically do that with any of these just edit free transform grid thingy make it try to make it square try to have talent have no talent Tell, tell your mom that you have no talent. Have your mom tell you you have no talent. Uh, life. And there you go. And as you can see, you kind of fucked up. It will uh, affect your little, uh, uh, what do you call it? Stroke. I think you can fix it. Just select those pixels again. Edit. Stroke. Yeah, I remember. I actually didn't change anything. All right, select, deselect, and everything's fixed. It's like you didn't F it up at all. Except you did, we all know you did. But anyways, let's have a little practice on how to uh, add dialogue. Well, create a new layer. Creating a new layer is probably the most important step and it will be the one you forget the most. Go over here and because we're lazy and we don't know how to do things. Actually, the first thing you should do is uh, Make your type type. And let's see. Let's go with ooh Comic Sans. Why? Because somehow it irrationally pissed you off. Make sure it's uh, at a readable level. I guess 18. The BTS love cannons. How do you spell cannons? Uh, who cares? Also, I think I spelled that as bitches. Well, that's fine. Also, if you want to change anything about your lettering, be sure to actually highlight everything. Give me white. It is bit bitch. <laughs> then we'll just call that an accent mark. Press OK. And then go to the layer below. Press a uh, new layer. Get your. What do they call this? Marquee tool. Yo, e, e. Trying to make it good. You probably won't make it good. Get the lasso. If you know how to draw, actually use the lasso. But if you don't know how to draw, do what I do and just use the polygon lasso. And now we fill it up. And then we stroke it. We stroke it real good. We forgot. Dang it. Okay. This will also be the one that you forget a lot, but this is the one that doesn't matter if you forget. This, forgetting to add the layer, will be the one that actually matters. Because that's the one where you'll be going, Control Z, Control Z, Control Z! Press OK. That's a bit big. Can we fix it? Yes, we can. Control Z. Then we stroke. Let's go with, I don't know, two. Does this one matter? A little bit. It'll prevent a little more, uh, what do you call it, like pixel lines. Press OK. That's a little better. Select. Deselect. And there you go. I added really bad dialogue. So if you have any questions, uh, be sure to ask them down in the comments. Subscribe. Hit the bell thingy? I don't know. I only have like five videos. Anyways, y'all have fun.